There's a problem in the water running through Macomb County. Investigators trying to find the source of this. It is sheen and it is coming from diesel fuel and spreading through the Red Run drain. Yeah, it's kind of a mystery right now. The county hopes that new absorbent booms will contain it, but now they need to find out where's it coming from. Jermont Terry is live in Clinton Township with more on this investigation. Jermont. Steve, I'm standing along the Clinton River. If you take a look over my shoulder, you can see that the booms are out. Now, they are hoping that it will stop this diesel fuel from getting into Lake St. Clair, because if it gets that far, then it could affect our drinking water. It's not a matter of what's in the water in Macomb County. The mystery is how is diesel fuel getting to the Red Run and flowing all the way to the Clinton River? And this week we've been sort of chasing it all week long. It started at the uh, county line between Oakland and Macomb County. The Macomb County Public Works Director Candace Miller tells me people spotted the sheen last weekend. However, the problem has occurred multiple times since 2016. We have now developed a zero tolerance, so we are on this stuff. We're not going to let this happen anymore. Booms are noticeable throughout off the river. It's unclear if the diesel is seeping into the water from an old business or worse, someone is intentionally dumping it. Probably not a property owner. It could be a business or something. So we are working with our partners in Oakland County to identify exactly what the source of this is. And I'll tell you, if we find somebody who's just doing this, you know, on purpose or even negligently, uh, we intend to prosecute to the fullest extent under the law because this cannot happen. Municipalities are doing their part in trying to prevent the spread because if the sheen gets into to the Lake of St. Clair, then there's a bigger problem. But this is not a water source for anyone drinking source, is it? Or no, no, it no, is no, but eventually when it goes out into the lake, it is right? right. We all drink it. We want to recreate in it. The fishes are trying to swim in it and we just can't have any of this contamination. Now, Commissioner Miller believes that she is closer to zeroing in on the exact area where all of this is starting. However, if you think you can help them in this investigation, you might know the source. They do have a hotline. We want to share that number with you. That number is 877-679-4337. Reporting live in Clinton Township, I'm Jermont Terry, Local 4. All right. Thank you, Jermont.